That's not bad at all. Great job. A deal's a deal. Here. You're a lifesaver. Here. Every grade A seed hunter deserves some sort of bonus for their work. I've got a story for you. Care to hear it? People have been alive for hundreds of years. You'd think people would go crazy with no end in sight, but most folks manage to get on with their lives as usual. Don't you think that's a little strange? It's as if they've lost something. It's like there's something missing. Years ago, one alchemist concocted a theory about it. According to him, the part of what's missing from us, from all human beings, is the soul seed we're all born from. But he wasn't happy just proposing a theory. He wanted to test it too. You know what he did? He consumed a seed. He extracted its essence, whipped it into a potion, and drank it. What do you think happened to the alchemist next? Moments later, he threw himself into the chaos, never to be seen again. Maybe once it was consumed, the soul seed transformed into some kind of poison. Or maybe he was able to retrieve the part of him that was missing, but was unable to deal with the world's reality. I guess we'll never know. Are you looking for someone? Huh? Oh, yes. Yes, I am. My six friends. Did you lose them somewhere in the crowd? They just disappeared and didn't even leave a feather behind. Leave a feather? Ah. These friends, are they pet birds? Pets? Absolutely not. No, we were raised together. Well, you see, the truth is, I'm really a chocobo. Uh, are you sure? Oh, yes. I was born on a farm out in the wildlands. I was named Primrose after the flower, which is yellow, just like I was. 
We live together in a cozy little hutch. Wait a minute. Let me get this straight. You're saying that you're not human, but a chocobo with wings and yellow feathers. That's right. Well, I mean, I was. Back on the farm in the wildlands with my six friends. But then one day we were supposed to move to a new home in Yusnam. We boarded the cargo train bound for Yusnam, and that's when it came. The chaos, I mean. You got split up from your friends. Yes. I haven't seen hide or feather of them since. And the very worst thing of all, somehow I ended up turning into a human. So that's why you've been going to places where chocobos might gather, searching for them. I had to do something. I just have no idea where they may have gone. We promised each other we'd always be together no matter what. Right. Well, if what you say is true, it must be hard for you. I'm sorry. Could you do me a favor? If you run into my six chocobo friends, could you tell them what happened to me? I really can't tell chocobos apart, but I'll see what I can do. Now you're sure they're not around here? Oh, yes, I'm sure. They aren't all grown up like the chocobos here. We're still pretty young. A hunt for six chocobo chicks. Hope, is there any way to pinpoint them? No, not with these sensors. But I can search the city records in case anyone's reported lost chicks. Bingo, here it is. Six reports and six missing chocobo chicks. Well, at least the numbers seem to match up. Please help me! I need you to find my six friends! She really seems to think that she used to be a chocobo. The question is, do you believe her? No, Hope. I don't. It's absurd, I agree. Then why volunteer to... I feel sorry for her. Chick found. This little fella is lost? You don't say. Well, if you have to take him back to his friends, it can't be helped. I'm gonna miss him, though. You found the first chocobo chick. Aha! Uh -huh. Was this little... 
another one waiting on you because he's been here a very long time. I only know because I've been sitting here for ages as well. The fool I call my boyfriend is late again. You've got two. Now to find the other four. Good luck. belong to you? My parents found her, but I don't know where. Brought her home and said they were gonna grill her with salt. So I rescued her before they could. But if you're the real owner, then you should have her. It's only right. Light, that's three down. You're halfway there. That's one chick found. Oh, so this little chick belongs to you. In case you didn't know, he's been here for a while. Well, you're safe now. Mommy's here. <laughs> I bet you can't wait to go home. That's four of them. Only two to go. you wow seriously you'll take the chocobo off my hands what a relief i found him stuck inside one of the luggage carts i read every regulation but there wasn't a single mention of chocobo chicks but now i can report in the logbook that the lost animal was claimed by its owner case closed go on he's all yours that's five chicks you only need one more. Yeah. I hope you can make everyone's wishes come true. Everyone! You look really upset. Yeah, bet you can't guess why. Don't tell me. You were dumped. No. Uh, I mean, yeah. I guess so, pretty much. We were supposed to go on a date. It was set. I made us a reservation at the Banquet of the Lord. Do you know how hard that was to get? Being stood up is never fun. Yeah. Now I've got to cancel it. I can't go alone. Unless, that is, you want to go? Then it wouldn't be a total waste, would it? Wow, how could I say no? I know, I know. I'm not good at talking to women. I just wanted to sit and watch the fireworks together. My girl looking gorgeous in her best dress, the colorful lights reflected in her eyes.
That's really his problem, not mine. I'm not obligated to keep him company.
Sounds good. There you are. Ah, uh, good, good. Uh, I was hoping the owner would turn up. He was a hungry stray, so I've been looking after him and feeding him. Oh, but he's all yours now. That's it, number six. You should take the chicks back to where Primrose is waiting. She should be in the honors court. I've got some good news for you. I found all of your missing friends. You, you have? And all six of them? They're safe and sound? Thank you. What a kind human you are. Look, can you see? My friends are saying thank you as well. Uh, you're welcome. When the first chaos swept us away, I, I didn't know what to do. So I prayed. I prayed for someone to help me and that I wouldn't be taken away from my friends. Don't lose them again. Oh, I won't. I can promise you that. We're never gonna let that happen again. And now it's time for me to return to my normal form. Thank you, Savior. about this as you are. Maybe the person we talked to was just an illusion. 
created by this little one's desire to be with her friends again. 